basically just showing, as Tony was talking about, what the thermal difference is between the, the different components. And in order to most accurately show the component temperatures, we're using a, a water cooling system. As Tony said, if we had a fan blowing on this, it would take the heat away so you wouldn't be actually able to see the, the temperature differences. But, um, so, as I said earlier as well, this is uh, running a, a full CPU load. This is a, um, a 6700, I believe, CPU, so it's four cores, each of them running at 100% uh, full loading. And the temperature difference right here, uh, right now the P5K is at 76 uh, for the choke, and ours is at 46.8. Uh, Mo's fit, theirs is at 77 or 78.7, and ours is at 53.7. And for capacitor, uh, theirs is at 59.5, and ours is at 45.9. So this is definitely showing there's quite a, a difference between uh, temperatures for the for the different components. Um, so again, as Tony was saying, in, increased stability, reliability, overclocking. Be more room to overclock if your your temperature is already lower. So, and you guys are free to take pictures and come up and take a look. <laughs>